sorry. All right, what's this match? It's Matt and Kyle. It's the same matchup that we play every week. Yep. I'm on the play, though. I don't think I'm always on the play. Uh, no turn one thoughts. Oh, 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 wow. Draw for turn. That was like a sketchy hand. I know. Cavern Merfolk. Mm -hmm. Tap it for a green, and we will play a Cenote Scout. It's going to go explore. I'm actually going to go ahead and put that guy into the bin, and we will put a 1-1 counter on You have two cards left. Sure. It is. Ooh. I have not been thought seized, and my creature has not been killed. This is a first. I know. It's <laughs> like a real turn. sketchy hand for me to, <laughs> to keep. I uh, drew it. I will I was play like, yeah, a man. This is tied channel pathway. Do I want a second one for main board? Tap two. Play a deep root pilgrimage. And we'll attack, creating a merfolk, basically. And then I will pass turn. <laughs> <laughs> Those are hexproof. No, yes, these guys are hexproof. So no, just for the sake of it, I need to get ready for this. Okay. Anyways, there is the official token, with the oh, actual rules text. Alright, now I'm gonna go for it. Uh, destroy the. Machine. Yeah. So we'll eat your it destroys creature. Nice. Yeah. I will lose one. Okay. So you're gonna get the trigger. Yep. Oh no, no, that's still here. That's not a creature anymore, so it dies. Uh, do you gain one? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I think you can do No, no, yes. I, I, I'm using you for one. I, I confused oh, myself. Oh, it's no longer crew. Oh, okay. Yep. So, yeah. seven, three. Oh, wait, first. Um, I get to do the land thing first. Did you get the discovery? Oh, um. Sick. I think I am. Yeah, I think I do this first. I don't think it matters. I have a moment it's better off taking it, so I'll go down to 15. That's okay. what I threw on the bottom. Right? And then I will pass. Because I had so much gas. Yeah, so I was like, oh, shoot. Uh, I gotta really try to find a way to build myself back. Okay. Um. Just the straight one right now. How many cards do you got? I got four. And it will be turned. Um, it hurts, but I think it's the first way to turn. Yeah. Shot myself with a green queen. Go to 13. That's fine, And then I will tap a blue and a cavern souls yeah. for Just green or whatever. And I'm going to hex catcher. Like, how did this deck ever I'm going to tap a <laughs> blue and play a benthic five on this one. I'm going to combat. We'll swing with both. Trigger, um, make a merfolk. Uh, and it'll be two, uh, five, total. Okay. Yeah, but I'm not going to do that. I'm just gonna, you're not going to attack any spells. So, so. I cast two spells. Okay. Um, that, that, that was specifically okay. the only card. So two cards. I have two cards. Okay. <laughs> you can just improvise. I have to tap them. It works really good. Oh, improvise, you have to tap them too. Yeah, okay, I didn't know. It works really good when I have like the long good clues. Because then, and that when you don't have to tap them. Yep. Super normal. <laughs> okay. Because then you think spell uh, beers. Uh, like uh, destroy, not destroy. Yeah. Okay. And and I will pass and hopefully not die. I mean, I guess you don't have deep root. Yes, right. And I don't have any untapped tap in the hands at the moment, so. So I should be safe for a turn. A turn. I guess I should have just passed and made it daytime or nighttime. I don't know, I just wanted to be tapped out when I cast that. Hinterland Harbor? Uh, untap because I do control a forest in an island. Um, that means you, it actually comes in tapped oh. with two I, triggers so you get to generate an extra mana. Like, I'm just kidding. I was actually wondering how it was worded. <laughs> I'm like, uh, it comes in extra untapped because you have full. <laughs> That'd be amazing. Like, if a land could do that, uh, it'd be so broken. Uh, River Snake. Yeah. Uh, then I'm going to adapt I my um, bio answer, way, and I will draw a card and discard a card. Oh. We will discard a Hinterland Harbor. And this is where the interesting point of the game is. Um, oh. I will look at your board and see I can get, I'll lose one creature if I swing in, and the bow side has a 2 -tick. So we'll go ahead and tap them all, and throw them all at you, making one workbook. Uh, so it's two, four, six total. That's a two-two, correct? Yes. Yep. 
block with the green trespasser. Yep. So you take one, two, three, four. Yep. Good. Uh, technically, he is a two-two. I guess plus one, plus one. It's not going to matter, and that will be my turn. I'm going to draw a card. Yeah. Go to my turn. Draw a card. Yeah. Was either of those the land that I needed? Ooh. Nope. You're that dead yet? Yes. <laughs> it was not the land. I I, that's what I'm saying. I, we knew it was not a land. We know this matchup. Right. And he's gotten the curse. To I, I have no to lands. get to five lands. I've drawn two extra cards, and I haven't. Put, you know, that's right. lands. Uh, boy, uh, might be the death, of me, but I'll thought sneeze you. That's probably not. Hexcatcher. Yeah, it has to be. Yeah. I was like, if I can get this hex catcher down, I think I'm pretty yeah, much going to be able to see it out. That would be lethal. That would be. All right. Well, we will uh, draw for turn. Play hex catcher. <laughs> well, now we have to do the math. Um, plus one, plus one, unblockable. It's going to be so. This was going to be four unblockable, and then that's going to be. Sorry. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Two, four, six. Yeah, you just smashed it. Of it course it broke. Four. Nine. Is the button that locks the screen locked? It erased. Is there a lock on? Is there a screw on? It's. Hey. Yeah. Yep. It's not the first. It's not the first time I've had to replace somebody's I've, because. I've had this sitting <laughs> in my bag, just getting colored on. All right. So this is four. Yeah, it's gonna be four unblockable because when they attack, an another one's gonna ETB, and I can actually make it five, but I don't think it's gonna matter. No, I, I can. Yeah, it's lethal because I can these, block the biggest one. And, and these are still yeah, X-proof anyway, yeah. so. I needed. I had the invokes yeah. in hand. Yeah, to I was, get rid of the. I was sitting there like I'm looking at my board after, especially after you remove the uh, hex catcher. I'm like, if if he has the the board wipe or the invokes now, it's just over. Okay, so let's do a little PSA for these. This isn't the same one he has, but this is the reset button. It doesn't reset. There's a lock on the side. Now it resets. Or you could be cheap like mine, not have a reset button. There should be one on the back. No, nah, this one's too old, and uh, this is like first gen boogie board. Gotcha. Uh, it might yeah, have a screw so, though; you can actually replace so the battery. It's kind of funny because someone bought one of these for me, and then they were like, "It, it broke. It won't reset. I need to buy another one." So they bought another one, and then they're like, "This one doesn't reset either." And I was like, "Is it locked?" And they're like, "Oh, I thought that was the battery compartment locked." And I'm like, "No, that's that." <laughs> nice. They should put a full key on it. Uh, sorry, the the uh, key, the uh, coin key. There we go. Yeah. Give me six. All right. Do I actually need a sideboard or anything in this matchup at the moment? Uh, these could do something, but yours is... The invokes are sacrifice, so that doesn't help. I'm going to try it. Yeah, you can't find it. Boy, that is a lot of temporary lockdowns, too, I would say. Don't find it. Oh, yeah. Pass turn. I might have to buy new sleeves again for tomorrow because I'm still drawing everything in pairs. Me and my lands didn't cooperate very well there. Which yeah. is par for the course, oh, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's Which means that in all likelihood, you're probably going to have a great game this game. And then game three just get flooded. The first turn. The mana curses are strong. Four cards in hand. Four cards in hand. Four cards in hand. I'm really glad damnation's not finally legal. It basically is. 
it, I guess more or less. Oh, I guess. With, well, I mean, like, a true four mana of Wrath in Black. Yeah, I mean, you have Rituals of Extinction. Right. Yeah. A little more conditional. I suppose but. doesn't. Damnation say they can't yeah. be regenerated. I think so. Yeah. Not yeah. That relevant. relevant. Yeah. It is. Much way less relevant in Pioneer than it is modern. Or older format, so. Yeah, I just shouldn't have played the Rat Lantern. Oh, Brett's playing Pack. Uh, yeah, yeah I think after, after last week, yeah, I think so. There's a few of them. No, I knew I'll I didn't play have first. Yep. Makes All sense. Right. Stupidest, greediest hand ever. I'm very <clears> tempted, <throat> but the only lands Odawara. There's two Cenote scouts. There's two Biomancers, um, and there's a Deep Root. I'm not. Doing that, so. I mean, if I hit a green land, <laughs> it would have been amazing. But that's also when you don't look at the top of your library. Oh no, I didn't. Yeah. Because you're like, you look, you're like, oh, it was a forest. I'm on the draw. It would have been perfect. Oh man, I just. I would have had so. I just shipped the best hand I could. I would have had so many bodies. So early. that being said, I still don't have a. I might need to put a Kumena back in. I just don't feel like I'm getting my uh, tap out. It's quite enough. Am I nice? Yeah, you want to name it? Oh no, it's just not nice, but I could craft the treasure. But I don't want to. That's a go. <laughs> oh, six. Will you be better than seven? It's not much different. You know, the truth is. It legitimately is not that much different. Yeah. <laughs> it was a, I had much more green, but only one blue still. And I just added two more, you saw in last game, two more split lands to the deck to try and prevent this. And, uh, I added one Takanuma. Took out a swamp, so I have two Takanuma now. Okay. I mean, how much you can just use, how valuable it is just to have it? Yeah, Even I mean, there's a, not much cost with running a second one. So if you yeah. draw them both, you can always tap it and play another, tap that one. I, but when you need ability, mana, it feels really bad, but the ability is, I think, more versatile than some of the others. Getting, getting the fifth copy of Shielder is pretty relevant, so... Yeah. I was making so many rats on the head and stuff. Oh, I'm sure. Yeah, it's not. can't believe how happy I played. Pretty much perfect five. It's okay. It's okay. Probably two copies of Deep Root in there right, because you're so gonna probably have a turn one sauce. That'd be pure. Fifty for one. No, no, just bad. Oh, just bad. They're just stop thinking. Okay. When you, okay. I, think bad. Turn, I think on the play, turn two thoughts. Okay. That's fair. Because they get the draw. Yeah. Out. yeah. And we know how you like to have one on top no, of your deck. No, no, I knew exactly how bad that was. Always have an extra. Both, both games last week. I, <laughs> Definitely could kill it. Yeah, it wasn't even a bluff to be like to make you think about it. Which and you end up doing. Well, oh, that's a mistake. Yes. Ready? Ready? Yes. Swing. Your turn. Drop your turn. Okay. Uh, shock myself. That must be how I will. Then play my favorite Sonote Scout. I mean, it's a push. It's mutable. Go to him. Yes, sir. Thosnies? Yes. Yeah. 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 Pass. Ooh. Hunter. Take a drop. Uh, I will play a... But it will be there instead of my graveyard. And... I don't listen to you. I don't play well. Oh, yeah, because it gets exiled with this. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, so over here, I'm going to pass my turn. I still think it's this one. Path two, and play a Deep Root Pilgrimage. <laughs> Go to combat. Mm -hmm. yeah, Swing one, make a merfolk. Yeah, it, it's a duck killer. Uh, Pass turn. Three, 
we'll play restoration. And deck is just trolling at this point. Oh, so so wow, not a bad time going. I'll be honest, I'm not actually sure which one of these you specifically take. I think it's just a you don't just count around. Right, I would say it's, it's how you feel about your deck at the moment, so. Okay. Hex catcher gets me in four turns, basically. Three turns, maybe. Um. Pilgrimage. Uh, no mutable. But I have removal spell for the sketcher, so um, I don't care. Yeah. Another long goodbye. <laughs> to be fair, I'm running two places. So. Okay. I mean, you have to. <laughs> it's just the only way to deal with it. We're going to go ahead and yeah. play the hex catcher. We're going to tap one and we're going to play the Biomancer as well. We'll go to combat. We'll swing. Oh, no, go to combat. Kapow! Yeah. Uh, two? Yep. Two, and I make another more folk. And then I will pass turn. Plus four, plus four, and so on. Four. Okay. Plus four, plus four. Off of the something in the battlefield. Off of the sensors. Okay. So in response, I'm just gonna, as you target, I'm draw. Gonna right. Take two. Oh, God. My top decks. So much. <laughs> so there's been a brief change in my main board. Make it a frog wizard? I probably should have done this in response to you blocking something, but I don't you care. Tough, uh, I tough. don't, unfortunately, have the token, which is really uh, annoying because I don't have anything specific for it. Need? A 3 3 frog wizard? Copy. It's got really high. Yeah, I have one. 3 3. Yeah. I left those at home. And then I'm going to have to pay two, and I'm going to adapt because you're still a little bigger than me. And I will draw a card, and I will discard an island. Uh, Yeah, I did misplay that. Oh, well, is that That's exiled or destroyed? It's destroyed. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. make sure. You say pass. Yes. So I'm at seven. I'm expecting the like right. Takanuma and then or just the Knight of Shield to the hand. Do you have a creature? Hex catcher. We'll eat that. Um. Uh, I will play a Benthic Biolancer. A2 and put a 1 1 counter on him. We'll draw a card. <laughs> you so don't deserve so I'm not going to do that. You won a million percent of short sight of the short That's greedy, greedy monster. Uh, you tapped out and you did it. Supposed to Does not still help me to attack at the moment, so I will pass turn. So, I pass turn. This is not where I want to be against your deck. What's downside of triggering this? You cast this spell. It stays dead. And then I can draw Exile, but I don't have to. Okay. It doesn't matter. It's good later when I just have Hamlet and Enchanted and I'm just trying to get insane. That's what I'll do. Oh, boy. That hurts. Yeah. Yep. You get your frog back. Yeah, he, he just... Excited. You have a preference between the Cenote Scouts and a Benthic? So Dream uh, one. Yep. Then so I'll take the three. Yep. So 17 to 11 is what I've got. Uh, yeah. And then I'll pass. Turn. Why so late? Any tricks? No. Oh, I guess I, I, guess I saw 2-2. Two, two. It's not 3-3, three, three, my bad. Uh, tap 2. Tax country. Ah. Tap 1. Missed call. Got it. Uh, last turn. Uh, what are you going Yep. And stuff, I get a human. Yep. Yes. Good. So it's a one so one and that's a two two. Yep. Second. Oh, yep. I yeah. So what's the third? Uh, no box. The third is it's a so we'll creature with that. Yep. yep. I'll go down to uh, seven. seven. Eighteen, 18, 18 and, 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 and okay, the other side is the right side. 
So what is this at? This should be at three. That was on the turn before. Oh. Yep. You missed that. Well. I think I'm dead. Yeah, I moment. We'll pay two. We'll play a QR spot. Mm -hmm. I'll go to combat. We'll swing three. Make a one one. Mm -hmm. And then I will pass the turn. Channel five. Yeah. Um, yep. Go to my turn. Yep. Did you cast two spells or one? Cast one. Okay. That's a three. Right. Still here to this. Yeah, you said five. Oh, no, all good. All good. Just making sure. I got a man. Um, That's what I was like. Uh, I thought it was wrong. I thought it was bad. But no, it's fine. 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 Like I said, I keep drawing in pairs. I get a two-two white visual I mean, I, I really couldn't have stopped really it anyway. Uh, I mean, it can't I happen this turn anyway, so yeah. The only person left on Earth playing that card and it comes up. Yeah, so I can pass her. So that's excellent. Yeah. That's probably. Um, this guy does have vigilance, which helps a little bit. You have enough. Around, but I have to pass. Do you have vigilance in something else, or just vigilance? Um, just vigilance. Okay. Untap. Part of the cards, this has to be not a land. You got it. Power up for if, it, if that wasn't a deep root pilgrimage, I wasn't going to win. If it was a deep root, I won because I'd go wide and force you'd have to do something. But I'd be able to, um, you'd, you'd have to force so me to draw. I would, yeah, I would be able to draw half a peril or. I could counter them. That's true. Because I'd have an That's infinite true, counter. Yeah. So you wouldn't be able to cast a non creature spell. So you'd have to. Oh, yeah, you wouldn't be able to cast a non creature spell. So you'd have to be able to make me draw without a cast. I've been playing. Okay, yeah. okay. I can't block that. Much. Taking that copter probably was definitely two the right choice because honestly, there, after so. you killed, especially if you killed the first X I'm like, if I had the copter yeah. right now, this would be a different game. You just have to yeah. the bodies. This lockdown. Like I had one removal spell at that point. But right. It's just good. I also like I do have a go for the throw main deck that I know, can't but he had four so. and two other creatures. I'd but you already have the pilgrimage, so you can just do it with everything you play. Yep. Yeah, so. Every non-token that I'm not willing to plunge into you is going to get into that, so that I can make another one-one. Yep. I should just go I probably kind of hit ten because I didn't have a secondary artifact. All right, Dad. Let's uh, let's see more of it. I didn't see a lot of the cards that game. You surprisingly yeah. only oh, drew I'll like three crap. lands for the longest time. I drew like my first two turns were all lands. Oh, I guess you did filter with Fenthic yeah. Biomancer. Too. I, I discarded an island, I discarded a cavern. And you're, if you play a lot, that one just. Oh, it gets, yeah. <laughs> I actually almost discarded the cavern instead of the island in the first one, too. I'm like, I don't care about encountering me. Yes, right, yeah, any color, color, but I have green. I played on turn two. Yeah, base is just safer. Yeah. Though I actually never really mind too much if people blow up the caverns and stuff because 
I mean, I guess I, if I had something, I could just transform it. I'm not going to live long enough to find out either. Game's tired of getting all the finishing stuff in my hand, my opening hand. Oh, I'll die. Wait, wait, wait. I'm blocking. Your issues are strong, and your... All right, YouTube viewers. Do you keep that hand? I'm gonna guess it's a cursed hand. I'll reveal it. Someone. I was gonna say generally five lands. Oh, the one lander. Okay. But it's Urborg. I mean, you look. You could have killed so many things for so long. Like I had, I had. Four removal spells. If I. I think I already riffled it. Oh. Sam, it, I think I already mashed it together. But. To be fair, I, I sometimes think a, a hand of just kill spells for you against me might just be a great hand. I mean, it's not bad. If I had two lands instead of any of those cards in there. Especially if I don't hit a deep root. Well, you put any of those cards back and you replace it with a swamp and I would have kept that. Oh, yeah. I don't think I should run that yet. Good luck. It's so <laughs> it's, not, it's not the graveyard, it's not the, the searching that you can't do anymore. Oh yeah, keep it up. It does have, right, I'm doing it as pretty as I can. Deem that it's taken. It's pretty. So it's not too slow. Back off your other ones, you just don't want to use that. It does sunk it. It's not that bad. I always forget he does the damage. As you're writing, I'm like, put down that pen. Alright, now what? I pass. Alright. Yeah. I will start with a Cavern Souls on Merfolk. Tap for green. For my super favorite, Snow Day Scout. I, don't, I think in 100% of games you have that on turn. It, like, it makes my keeps way easier. I'm going to put that in the, the bin. I gotta hit you with the Thought Sneeze. Oh. Good timing. His only option on two mana was to cycle a shark type move for zero. He just didn't do it and then he ripped the lander. So, 100% chance that's the pilgrimage? Oh, maybe. I don't know. Yeah. I mean, it wasn't the shooner because I. I think you forgot you could cycle it for zero. No, you actively chose. It's an alternative copter. Yeah. So I'm not going to lie. I got super scared of Oh, okay. Well, because there's reasons. There's not many ways for you to win. Right. It's actually tough because. We'll take this, the shooter. Okay. Pause. It's, that's a tough one because of what's in my hand. If I left in one fatal push for that ball specifically. Have appropriate or not appropriate removal? Yeah. Uh, actually, what I put on the bottom lines up better against your hand than what I kept. But it doesn't mean you can't draw out of it. We'll play a breeding pool tapped. Yeah. yeah, I mean, swing two. Six. It's more just to like save off. And that's right. And lock it down. That's right. It is. Um, we will play a. <laughs> I don't care to flip it and Mark Channel Path. I don't get to tap three for a Sentinel of the Nameless City. Go to combat, swing two. Oh, he makes a foul. You know how I just can't crack it. Because I could have activated it. That's him. Yeah, do you have to tap him? That's fine. It's not cool. So it's you and the treasure goes away. Cool. My turn? Yep. Really um, mature you. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to do this on my turn in case you draw or have drawn so Hexcatcher. So let's feel the Bruin, your Breeding cool. Pool or Cavern. Right, so or actually, you can do any of them, yeah. I'm going to go with Breeding Pool. Okay. And uh, I can go yep. get a. Found the loophole. Got it. Yeah, so ETB's untapped. Do you have two cards left? Oh, Correct, yeah. yeah. You have zero mana open. Zero yeah. mana open. Um, naturalist. Yeah, well, you're not. Your people are just well. Naturalist, I'm going to push this. I'm just going to push this. Which yeah. then I get to discover. Yeah. No, it's yeah. such a rude way to trigger the revolt. I know, it's like literally my only way to trigger the revolt. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, like, as dumb as the card candy trail is, yeah. I swear this deck was, like, more land consistent than this. Like, it gave you eight and more, or eight ways to trigger revolt and, like, cleaning up your draws. Have you tried or thought about just putting it back in? I thought about it, but I don't know what I'd take out. Well, I'm going to go ahead and play an island. I'm going to tap a... Oh, we still have a cavern, so we'll go with these two. And we'll play a deeper elite. 
Um, I will use my map and I will target it. my one that can attack. So no taste scout. And we will explore. We'll leave that guy there. Put the one more guy there. Go in and try and hit you with the three. Last turn. It's gone. One, two, restoration. Sideways. Okay. We'll exile something in there. Uh, it really, it's, no, it doesn't drain. Just exile. Okay. Uh, four, five, death touch, and three, three minutes. Three, three minutes. So I'd have to throw both in front of it. So it's seven. So it's going to put me to 11 on my draw. No, I'm where I got. Tier at 18. Yeah, so that's gonna put me at nine on my draw. And I kind of don't know how I other. If your children is just literally back there. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and then at nine you're you're dead to. I mean, I hope we will. If my only ways out will generally mean I can hopefully counter if you go right, that yeah, big. Yeah, that's true. Um, but you can still probably get enough damage after that. I'm just, I'm just going to go take it. We'll go down to the 11. Okay, and then I'm just going to mark myself down to 9 now because I can't prevent it until uh, after draw for anything, anyways. Draw. Unless it was Tide Binder. Uh, I did not put them in. Oh. They're sideboard, and I didn't bring them in because Rapid Hype I moved. I was looking at about tomorrow, and I'm going to be prepared for a Malia combo. And if I don't have main board removal, I'm just forfeiting game one. Gotcha. So there's three main board rapidizations right now. So. I saw that was really busted. Yeah, yeah. Now, this is the interesting question. I'm going to activate four blocks and see what that is. Yeah, that's good. Okay. I can't have Sorry, I think I can't stop Matilda. I think. I couldn't get it out of this. So that was exactly Seth's against you. So that's why I knew I didn't have this. Yeah, plus yeah, yeah, the draw yeah. step. Yeah. Was no, it, that is seven. Yes. So with the draw step to nine. Yes. That's what I thought you were getting on. That's seven plus the draw no, step brings I'm, you to zero. I'm trying to figure out if I could somehow get to next turn. And I don't think I can. Wait. Block it. Yeah, oh, yeah, no, I just do it. Mm, yeah, we'll see what happens. I'll, I'll try. <laughs> Blocking we'll try. gets well, you a turn. <laughs> it, you'll, you'll, you'll see. I'm going to shock myself. Okay. We're going to pay two, and we're going to play if you are a follower. Now pass her.
Yeah. I can do anything else I'm also for cool as well. One unknown card and three untapped mana. Yep, I'll tell you, I had this card in my hand the whole game. Yeah, I, I kind of figured... This <laughs> Sorry, turn, this is the first card you drew after your thought sees. Uh -oh. I mean, I kind of figured when you played a creature and then you used the map that you had nothing else. Um, Indestructible. I'll tell you. Okay. Well, exile that Yeah, cool. I have to run uh, line so, every time. Yeah, um, to no, I don't have to. I'm going to go ahead and tap my Merfolk well, yeah, all to my untap a land. I'm going to tap four mana. And I'm going to bounce your children. Sure. I'll take the three. Yep. I'll go to four. And I have the ability to untap. Mm -hmm. My turn? Uh, yeah. And because you couldn't play the children again, if this is a deep root, I think it. I, I might have it. Depends if you have to invoke or anything else after. You got. It. I mean, I don't have it yet. You're gonna play children, and I'm just dead. I can't block uh, both, and then I just die to untap. I don't have the mana to do both. You. Oh, that's true. I guess we'll see what happens. I'm playing. A, I'll play a land. I'm dead. I'm gonna. I'm gonna die. Look. Yeah, he's playing. Mean, he's playing a shieldred, and I'm gonna need to untap after he plays it to live. So he, so I'm here's the die. thing. Die. I. If I, well, I tried attack, to. I tried to concede. <laughs> attacking puts you to one, right? If I don't block. Yeah, and if you do block, you have nothing. Well, I'll have one creature back. They're two twos. They're men. Oh, that's true. Yeah, it doesn't have death touch. Everything else has death touch. Yeah. Um, yeah, no, 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 I'm <laughs> very familiar. <laughs> I forgot. Not everything has death touch. Yeah, I think it's so just play shield. Right. right. And then I'm going to play Bank Buster also. Okay. And then pass. So that puts you to two, assuming it's not yes. tied by me. Um, and to be fair, playing that is even better because had you attacked into me, I would have got the Agathos. So I don't have the Pilgrim Rush. You're just going to pass it back to me when I die. Yeah. So, GG's pass though. Yeah. So I, yeah, I flooded yeah. real hard there. Oh no, I knew. <laughs> I, I you were flooding and I just was hanging creatures. I don't want to yeah. keep a four land hand. Yeah. But it's like I had the curve and I'm like, I know we get thought sees, but and I probably should have left the schooner there. Cause I, had I left the schooner there, this might have been a different game. It's hard to say. It, like it's especially I, hard to know what the correct But I, yeah, but I know you're gonna thought seize me. Like, I know that's gonna come next turn. And I know that had I had the schooner there on the top, you would have for sure hit the, the center. Well, I mean, a more uh, so I said, kept but, yeah. Path of Peril and I pushed Long Goodbye, and my okay. other cards were Three Lands, Shieldred, and something. I don't even remember what the other one was now. Or yeah, and then I just kept trying lands. So like the Long Goodbye would have been better for the Sentinels, and the problem with the Schooner is I can't hit it with a Sorcery Speed removal. Because you're never gonna you're never gonna crew it on my turn. I I, so, I actually will. If I have a deeper well, pilgrimage on, on end step. Yes. Oh. So. Well, also, or sometimes not, maybe. That's, that's, yeah. No, I guess I could try to bait you like that. Yeah. Help yeah, this deck definitely felt like cool when I had back. more creatures in it and I took out all the board wipes, it really together. felt like it was yeah. missing mass. So cool. Oh, that's very fair. So and you get to do I, it again. I took out the tiny bones, I took out the two drops. Which I had been using after points, obviously, and then I right. tried the bats, and I didn't really care for the bats. Wait, so if you're so like that freed up six slots. Of it, so. creature, then it's Good games. Good games. Of 